I'm Callum. And I'm Emma. And, and this, this is, is your Bulldog, Bulldog News. News. Have you been to the book fair yet? No, is it still open? Yeah, but today's the last day, so if you haven't been there, you should go check it out. Now to an interview with Ms. Burkhart more about the book fair. Thanks to everybody who shopped at the book fair this week. Today is the last day for shopping, and don't wait for the end of the day, because we'll be packing up. If you forgot your money and you had something you really wanted, you can also shop online. The link is in the announcements or on the library webpage. They deliver the books free to school, and I will bring them to you in your class. So you can also shop online through Wednesday. Speaking of paper, have you heard of this sad film called Paper? No, what's that? It's a BTV film written by Phoebe Bensink, Oliver Abrams, and Simon Mullins. It won in the International Student Silent Film Festival. Good job, guys. And now to Heidi and Caitlin with the feature. Hi, I'm Caitlin. And I'm Heidi. And this is your Bulldog feature. Today is Celebration Friday. What's that? That's right, you haven't done it before, have you? No, I've only been here for what, two months? That's right. Okay, here's to an interview with Mr. Gilpin about why we do Celebration Friday. What is the purpose of Celebration Friday? Celebration Friday is an opportunity to uh, recognize students who are uh, being good students, um, not necessarily being sent to the office. Uh, they're doing their work. Um, we're not necessarily recognizing the A, B, C, D. It's more of that you're putting forth the effort that it takes to be a student here, meaning that you're not having more than three missing assignments. So this is a time to get you out of the regular realm of things going on, have a little fun, and to recognize the, the quality of work students are doing. Band and orchestra are going to Ismussen. You see an interview with a student about what's going to happen in ISMA. What is ISMA? ISMA is a competition that uh, Indiana, any orchestras, bands, choirs can play at and win medals of bronze, silver, and gold. And it's just really fun and we think that it's a great opportunity to play. Now to Bulldog Sports. Hi, I'm Peyton. And I'm Lauren. And this, this is your Bulldog, Bulldog Sports cast. cast. I hear you've been racking up those trophies with the Bulldog Award. Yeah, I did, but so did many other student athletes. Well, anyways, track has been starting up, and I hear they've been doing pretty good. Let's go to an interview with Cameron. How has your training for track season been? Our training for track season has been really hard, and we've put in a lot of effort, but it's been really fun at the same time. How do you think you will do this season? I think we'll do really well because we put a lot of time and effort into the practices and I think that'll pay off in the meets. Three. And now to your flashback Friday. What are all these people doing here? Well, Mr. Lincoln's training at the stop in town for supplies. Well, what are all these people doing here? Well, they're here to meet this man. Think of this new look you advised me to make. Thanks for last week's brain trainer was D. Davis. Now this week's brain trainer. Ah! Oh. This week's brain trainer is a famous line from a famous movie. Please tell me the name of the movie and the year it came out. I think we're going to need a bigger boat. Please report your answers to me.